Ever wondered about the most feared creature in Filipino folklore? A creature so terrifying it's been haunting the dreams and stories of the people for centuries? Let's delve into the eerie world of the Aswang. The Aswang is not just one entity but an umbrella term for a spectrum of shape-shifting evil beings that inhabit the rich tapestry of Filipino folklore. These entities range from vampires to ghouls, witches to viscera suckers, and even human-beast hybrids. A chilling array of nightmares, wouldn't you agree? Aswangs have long been a source of fear and fascination, their stories echoing through the archipelago even during the era of Spanish colonization. But what makes the Aswang truly terrifying is its ability to blend seamlessly into human communities. They infiltrate our world through marriage or as wanderers, slipping unnoticed into the fabric of everyday life. These creatures are nocturnal beings. They are most active during the hours shrouded in darkness, lurking in places that most of us would find unsettling, cemeteries and woods. Their activities are not for the faint-hearted, as they indulge in behaviors that starkly invert traditional Filipino values. Aswangs are described as inherently evil, with no specific motives beyond causing harm and devouring others. Each type of Aswang has its own unique disturbing characteristics. The vampire Aswang feeds on blood, much like the Western vampires we're familiar with, but with a terrifying twist, they shapeshift into an animal before their feast. The viscera sucker on the other hand, has a more gruesome feeding ritual. They consume the internal organs and body fluids of their victims, often leaving the body hollowed out. Then, there are the were-dogs, human-beast hybrids that prowl under the moonlight, and let's not forget the witches, practitioners of black magic and the ghouls who feast on the dead, each one a unique embodiment of terror, each one an aswang. But fear not, for every dark cloud has a silver lining. For as long as the aswang has existed in Filipino folklore, so too have the remedies and countermeasures to ward off or eliminate these creatures. Some believe in the power of prayer, others in the potency of certain herbs and spices. Some even say that an aswang can be revealed by a particular glance in a mirror, or the presence of a certain oil. To sum up, the aswang is a terrifying blend of various evil entities from Filipino folklore. They are shapeshifters, adept at blending into human communities active in the night, and are known for their inversion of traditional values. Each type of Aswang, be it a vampire, viscera sucker, were-dog, witch, or ghoul, brings its own unique brand of terror to the table. But remember, just as there are tales of their horror, there are also tales of how to ward them off. So sleep tight, and keep those remedies close.